Joining us now is Owen Ryan, the newly appointed Executive Director of the International AIDS Society. Owen, welcome to the job and welcome to Melbourne. Thank you, thank you. Why was it important, do you think, to, to bring the conference to this, this part of the world? Well, I think that there's two things, one plan and probably one not. You know, we want to make sure that the conference stays representative of our global community, and it, uh, coming to Melbourne was a great opportunity to spotlight the HIV epidemic throughout the Asia-Pacific region, and Australia has been a longtime supporter of the fight against HIV. Um, as Sharon Loon likes to say, they punch above their weight, and I think that's a great expression. Um, on the other side, you know, given the events of the week, Melbourne has been a community that has embraced us. Uh, everyone from the Lord Mayor to the Premier have really gone out of their way to to make sure that the conference and the conference community felt like Melbourne was a home for them and, and for that I really I can't thank them enough. It's the uh, 20th International AIDS Conference. How, how, how has the impact of the event changed o over those years? It's huge. I think that there are several conferences, and this will be one of them, that people will talk about for decades to come and how the AIDS epidemic changed as a result of that. You can think about moments where people stood on stage demanding AIDS treatment, and then as a result of the, the attention and the outrage and the activism around that, a real solidarity towards driving towards universal access, towards new prevention methods for people. The conference has really been a central organizing point for people to respond uh, in a really dramatic and direct way to the epidemic. And what do you hope will be, uh, be will, will come out of this conference particularly, I guess this being the 20th conference? Well, I hope that there's two things people take out of this. I hope that people see that um, we have come an incredibly long way. You know, we've moved from just even four years ago, talking about an HIV cure as if that was a really abstract con uh, concept to today having real um, authoritative scientific meetings on what that could mean for the future of the AIDS response. And then I think on the other side, we've realized that we have a really small window. Uh, Mark Dibel from the Global Fund talks about this really eloquently. A small window to make big change in the epidemic. And if we don't seize that in the next four, six, ten years, that we're going to lose that window and we're not going to have the opportunity to, to conquer AIDS the way we hope to. Well, Owen, thanks very much for joining us. and. Uh, all the very best for the conference. Great, thank you. Thank you.